The immigration figures for 2022 are out today and, as expected, they are catastrophic for the United Kingdom with over 600,000 net immigration into the country in one year. That includes 1.2 million who have arrived and about 600,000 that have left. It's not just illegal immigration across the channel that the fake Conservative Party have not got a grip on at all. They are accelerating legal migration, as they say, which is having a devastating impact across the country as there are not enough houses to house everybody coming. There are not enough school places. There are not enough uh, doctor's surgeries, dentist surgeries. There's not enough road space in a lot of places for people to be able to get around. And that's exacerbated by Agenda 2030, climate alarmist, low traffic neighbourhoods and so on, which make the situation worse. We need to get rid of this fake Conservative government that is actively working to increase net immigration. They stand up and they say, we're going to get a grip of it, we're going to get a deal with it, deal with it. But every time they say that, it gets worse. And they've had 13 years to deal with this. From the very beginning, they said they were going to reduce immigration, but it's got higher and higher and higher and higher and higher every year. Don't you see the game that they're playing? It is classic bait and switch. They say they're going to reduce immigration, but it gets higher every single year. It's at a level that is completely unsustainable now. The Heritage Party has a plan to stop this. We will get a control of illegal immigration. We'll get control of the so-called legal immigration with strict caps on student and work visas, which no one else is willing to do. Please come and join me at heritageparty.org to sort this problem out.